और अब बात कर लेते हैं भारत के गौरव में चार चांद लगाने की जी हाँ आज भारत इतिहास रचने से महज कुछ घंटों की दूरी पर है अंतरिक्ष यान लॉक और लोड हो चुका है और अब से कुछ ही घंटों में चंद्रयान तीन श्री हरिकोटा के सतीश धवन अंतरिक्ष केंद्र से उड़ान भरेगा अंतरिक्ष यान आज दोपहर दो बजकर पैंतीस मिनट पर उड़ान भरने वाला है यह एक ऐसा क्षण है ऐसा पल है जिसका भारत पिछले चार सालों से बेसब्री से इंतजार कर रहा था चंद्रमा पर भारत के तीसरे मिशन का लक्ष्य असंभव को संभव करना है जो इसके पूर्ववर्ती वो नहीं कर सका चंद्रमा की सतह पर सॉफ्ट लैंडिंग को पूरा करने की इसरो की क्षमता को प्रदर्शित करना होगा और और वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग रॉकेट बिग रॉकेट एलवीएम थ्री इन इट्स फोर्थ मिशन एम इज गोइंग टू लॉन्च चंद्रयान थ्री सो चंद्रयान थ्री विल स्टार्ट इट्स जर्नी आफ्टर द लॉन्च टूमोरो रीच अराउंड अर्थ then it will travel towards moon slowly over the next one month then uh, we are hoping that everything is all right then it will reach and land on the moon on august 23rd onwards any day it's going to be a game changer i i'm assuming and i hope that uh, it will be a successful mission because whatever is the problem in chandrayaan 2 actually we we are correcting the whole thing through a failure from the failure we have understood but then what i hope is afterwards afterwards this could uh, make uh, some kind of an uh, inspiration to the entire country uh, i am happy to note that the entire country is now anxiously waiting for this launch that is something interesting it's going to be a historic launch the launch of uh, chandrayaan 3 from sri hari kota launch station and i'm sure this is going to herald india's quantum leap in the global arena india has already reached a pedestal as far as its scientific and technological capabilities are concerned we had a very rich success story as far as the covid vaccine is concerned and now this chandrayaan 3 is going to reiterate india's indigenous capabilities and also firmly place india as an important uh, global player to reckon with engines are very similar uh, i would say almost 80% 85% similar uh, every mission which goes out of uh, isro uh, there are analysis which are done by the engineers and scientists and then they come up with several uh, suggestions and upgrades uh, a lot of simulations are done for uh, for chandrayaan so all this thing put together will give us a good result on uh, 23rd 24th august when it finally lands on the moon okay similarly if you could just explain the few uh, you know technicalities for a layman to understand that how these are going to be utilized and how these are going to be fitted in so any engine uh, has a thrust chamber of course which is a major part what you see uh, but above that there are uh, pumps turbines uh, uh, in, uh, injectors very small uh, injectors which actually mix the, uh, uh, the 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 fuel and then finally it gets fired सबकी निगाहें फिलहाल इसी पर टिकी रहेंगी आज मेरे साथ फिलहाल इस बुलेटिन में इतना ही देखते रहिए बनाना